Hello, what are girls in the French rolls? It's Dolph. Welcome back to my kitchen. And today I'll be serving you Sora Arc Break, a deck that uses your opponent's strength against them. And you're like, wait, Dolph, we've seen this before. This is your first breakthrough video. And you know, this card is so cool that I had to bring it back. But since you already know what the deck does, let's bring it through a tournament. Five booster pack tournament, and let's see if this thing can handle it. So I did a little bit of a tune-up, and I'm gonna go and explain this card really quick this time because you probably some of you may remember. And this is just a refresher. So, using your opponent's strength against them, Zora R. One energy foul play. You use one of your attacks or opponent's attacks against them. Hopefully they have a good one. Okay, next we have the little Zorark Break, who has Stand In. He can jump in right into the front, so don't worry about retreating if that happens. And Mind Jack. The story damage for every bench Pokemon he has, so use their bench against him if they have a big bench. Okay, and we last we have Evil Tall, which Evil Ball, the more energies they have, the more damage it does, so use their energy against him. You get the idea, right? So Turns out in the tournament there are pretty much none of these. <laughs> and I'm gonna have a pretty darn hard time getting through, but that's what you wanna see, right? You wanna see a struggle. So I'm just gonna quickly brace over the, the deck engine. This is Slurpuff, it grabs me cards. More of these, I get more cards. This is Tierno. Uh, draw all three cards. The goal is not keep all the cards in my hand because I am such a greedy jerk. And here we go, we have Roller Skates. Oh wow, just draw more cards, don't discard no other tricks than that. And I have Bridget. Gets me out my Zora, Zoruas, or my uh, Slurpuffs. Get them all on the bench so they can evolve and just quickly set up. Or he can just get me one evil tall, which sometimes is okay when I really just need one of them. Alright, now I added some Pokemon Center Lady. Because you're going to see how keeping my Pokemon alive, getting more value of them is important. You will see that. And of course we have the Parallel City, which has been missing from my past couple decks because they needed other stadiums but Parallel City's back to constrict their bench sometimes if you don't it, it helps more helpful that way or it uh, reduces their damage if they're using one of the three primary elements. Now I'm added in some wallies because this thing helps Zora our break comes out into the field much quicker and it has more hit points it can use a new attack and which is why we need to gust this thing out. What else? We got some evil sodas. I have a big evolution lines and it helps get out my slurp ups. And it works with Zoro Arc Break, which is why I'm not using Level Ball. I have Lysander. I really should add one more Ly We'll talk about that at the end, guys. But I have, I have two Lysanders, and when you're using your opponent's strength against them, you really should be able to choose which opponent that you're strength that you're using. You'll, you'll see more on that. And I have a Birch. Just in case I draw everything, Birch is there to reshut full my hand. I, this time I have more muscle bands because this thing is really critical for getting those knockout KOs. And we just have one float stone because really that's all you need. You can use the combo where you put this onto Zora Art and just retreat and pretty much your entire team has four retreat. Like Keldeo. Remember that card? Yeah, have you played for quite a while. Alright, more dangerous energies than last time. Because this thing really depends on your opponent's strength. If they don't got the strength, you gotta bring it from somewhere and just, hey, this has some damage, which you're gonna see a very funny case of. And I've got some double colors energy. Works in all my Pokemon except Slurpuff. Because Slurpuff doesn't attack. But yeah, it works with Mind Jack. It works with all of Evil Toll's attack, so that's good. Is there anything else you wanted to say? Oh, I have the iPhone 6. This is this gets you all the trainers, repeat them again. So, tournament, tournament matches. This is gonna be the five prize tournaments what uh what games do you have for you today this is semi-spoiler i'm not going to try to tell you much but skip on ahead if you don't like hearing this stuff first match we have a gyarados that destroys um oh, no that's nothing about it then we have a del fox which has some amount of energy then we have uh finally a gengar with the ability lock that has i'm using all ability uh, okay Let's just see how these Welcome to the first round of the tournament. Now, what am I up against? It looks like this is a fur frog wall. It does well 40 less damage whenever I attack it. Doesn't have too many high hit points. And we're gonna see a magic card. So it's real Pokemon to gear those guys. Now, I need some Pokemon of my own. I'm gonna get Bridget and completely fill up my bench with Swirlix and Zorua. So um yeah, I'm good to go. One energy here. 
I'll go ahead and put a muscle band on, and that's it. Parallel City. I'm gonna wait till he plays the stadium before I place that. Now the way I'm gonna face it, I'm probably just gonna shrink his hand because I need this deck space the way I'm setting this up. All right, all my Swirlix, all my Zorua's are down. Please, Tiano, Birch, Roller Skates, I need you. And we see Gyarados with two energies. It doesn't really want to face my uh, face my evil toll now. Nope. I drew into. I have Zor Arc Break, but I just need energies. I'll end my turn. This is not 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 the greatest uh well hand, but. Swarlix, some cards to get me more cards. So this thing has three energies, is ready to go, but he really does not want to get KO'd by my evil toll. So I got Zora Arc Break. Come on, draw the right card. Just I need the right card. I'll end my turn. That's it. Tiano, 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 come on. This is this is still so I have an army of Slurp up waiting to evolve. I just need more cards. But at this point, wow, four energies. He needs gonna need a lot of heads, guys. By this point, I can one-shot him with one energy. He may think, why is he attacking? He may just be baiting me. Uh, no, I really just need energy. So please, this is working for both of us. Yes! Heads. Heads. Heads, otherwise I'm still stuck in the same situation. No! Fine. Now, let's see. Can Zora Arc one-shot this? No, it cannot. He must not... Five energies! Oh my gosh, that's crazy! Slurpuff, Slurpuff, Lysander, he is he, he's going all going for luck now. All right, tasting, please taste me. Uh, energy, okay. I will save that energy because I know on either of these they're okay. I just need to grab that Gyarados and I I win. So, Muscle Band, he's re he's like I'm ready. Look at all these energies. Look how look how much this thing ha to takes to take on my Evil Doll. You don't want to wait for my Lysander, man. Now I'm getting two draws every single turn. So it's not it's not in his favor. He, he should come out and attack me, but nope. Okay. In this case, I may just go on the offensive guy. I got enough energies. Let's go on the offensive. We're going to use Evil Ball and start beating on this Fur Pro. 40 damage? It's coming. I'm making him feel like he's under pressure, which you are under pressure. You're gonna need a lot of heads to take me down. Otherwise, I can just like Xander and one shot you. It's like, nope, I'm gonna end my turn. Okay, I still don't have anything. So I'm still getting two cards every single turn, so I may just. Okay. Let's just go ahead and put energy onto Zora Arc. And that's it. We're gonna use Evil Ball. There we go. Almost done. Fur Pro, you can only live one more turn, man. One more turn. I could have placed energy on Evil to all. Oh. And finished it, but... Wow! Six energies! Is this all these coin flips gonna work? It, it might. And Zorahark does not enough damage to finish it off. Okay, chasing. I'm a, I, I want you, Lysander. You know what, at this point, let's just Wally. Let's just Wally, make sure we have Zorahark ready to go. Okay. You know what? Zora Arc, I may I may just send you in. I may just send you in because I have not let Evil Tall. The thing is, I know for sure Evil Tall can one shot it. Zora Arc cannot. So you know what? We're gonna use this we're gonna charge up the Zora Arc back down here. We're gonna stand in, and I'm gonna sacrifice you to take out this guy. So here we go. Foul play. I will use your energy cutoff right against you. 40 damage, still the same. It doesn't matter, you're gone. Thank you. Alright, another slur prep. I'm gonna get two more cards for turns. Hello, Gyarados! Nice to see you! And now he has an Eevee. He's wasted so much to put cards up here. Now, I, I'm gonna assume my Zoroark is gonna go down. That's that's just a given, guys. I can Wally for another one. But, Evil Talk just comes up. Man, you have way too many energies on you, and he will just destroy him. He does not know that. Lysander! Oh! That's the card I wanted! Aqua Tail, Tails, Heads, Heads, no, Tails, Heads, oh, that's so many heads, oh my god, 230 damage, ouch, ouch, well, it paid off, it paid off, he took 
<laughs> took a lot of energies, but he took it out. So, let's go ahead and... Uh, I shouldn't... I didn't really have to do that. Let's go ahead and tasting, and let's go ahead and find a way to counter this Gyarados. Alright! Well, at, at this point, I have pretty much all my Zora Arcs ready to go. And they're gonna get destroyed. Man, this Gyarados is gonna be... Kicking it! It's gonna get like three of my Pokemon. So, let's go ahead and grab these. And we're gonna use the... Slurpuff. We're gonna evolve Slurpuff, and now I have pretty much three card draws every single turn. Four, including the ones I normally get. Okay, there we go! I've met... <laughs> Finally, Tierno is here. Man, where were you, man? And he's like, uh, I've been dancing. Of course, of course, so... Oh my... Oh my... So many tales with that. Um... If I play Parallel City, I'm gonna eject my own... Stadium. I don't want to do that. You know what, I don't want him to heal every between every turn. Uh, this side, yeah, I'll squeeze this bench. There we go. This is good, so then I took done. And now, let's on on to combat. We'll stand in. I'm standing in for you. We're gonna copy Gyarados' attack. Which one? Which one does more damage? 90 or 80 in bench damage to everything? I'll, I'll do 90. I have no water energy, so it's just gonna do 90. Alright, so... I cannot survive more than one Tails. Pokemon Center Lake, gonna heal you up? Uh, oh my gosh. And he's got a Vaporeon up. Man, this, this, this Gyarados is a killer. Okay. Tails, tails, heads, t all oh, two heads. That was enough, that was enough. So that was 170 damage, wow. Okay. So I can do get 90 damage again, and yet this is, this is not enough. I need a muscle band. I need that muscle band, so please. Alright, Tasty, please give me a muscle band. I have three of them in there. Okay. Oh, skates. They're all tails, so this one's heads, for sure. Give me that muscle band. Okay, th this one, I don't know. I could really have all tails. Heads! Excellent, excellent, excellent. So, we're gonna grab out Tiano. There's that muscle band. Gee. Whew. 11 cards left. Okay. So now, this is enough. Oh, I still haven't used my Slurpuffs. Yes, let's get, get some more cards out. Why not? Why not? At this point, probably not. It's not going to help me so much. I'm just grabbing out anyway. You know what? We might just get another Zoroark going. All right. Foul play. Let's get this Aqua Tail. Get rid of this guy. 110 damage. Get out of here. Six. Can't believe this was a problem. But I'm a copycat. My strength comes from their strength. I meant to say something real cool, but it didn't turn out that way. So that's that. Okay. What co can I copy? Oh, I can knock you out for sure. Wow. Six. Six. Uh, oh, Lugia. Lugia's out. Oh, okay. But we're gonna we're gonna instantly KO this, and then we may. Well, I gonna have to deal with Lugia. Now, Lugia. I don't. I only have one energy, so this air ball is not gonna hurt me. I can copy his deep hurricane and destroy and one sh one shot him. Oh, I definitely could do that, guys. The stadium. It's nice, but look, he's not, he doesn't have that many Pokemon, so... Alright, Verse Seeker. Wait, what do you want from there? Pokemon Center Lady? He picked, he picked something. I didn't even know what, it, I didn't see. Wait, well, what was it? Game chat. He played a Verse Seeker. That's all I know. This is not saying anything in there. Okay. Great Ball. Next seven cards, what you got? Better not be another Gyarados, man, because that's, I can't handle it. Snorlax. Alright. Snorlax is out. Vaporeon cannot do anything whatsoever. I'm almost out of cards. I'm 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 just gonna casually charge up my evil tall guys. We're gonna fish this guy out. Hello, Lugia. And I'm gonna get rid of you. I'm almost out of cards. We're gonna use foul play. Deep hurricane. Get out of here. 170 damage due to my muscle band. See how big that thing is? So, I'll take two prize cards. And, okay, there we go. I, I, I'm back on track now. Back on track. Eight cards left, so we're not gonna use these slurp buffs. We may have to birch. Now we don't. Hi, Snorlax. I can I can copy your knock away. I do not 20 more damage, so this is potentially a lot. Alright, that's it. We're, we're, we're just gonna do this the hard way. Alright, let's go ahead and charge up the second Zora Arc. The third. I lost my I lost my first. Alright, and we're gonna charge up Evil Talk. Have some big damage power. And alright, foul play! Hey Snorlax, nice big expensive attack. 
cheap for me. 40 damage only. This is this really sucks. Because he has a plump body, and if he had a hard charm, this would be awful. Alright, uh, we got an Aqua. Aqua wants a dive ball. He can pick any Pokemon. Do not be a Magikarp, but another Gyarados. I don't want to... What is this? I like this. I think I'm going to drag it out and copy it, guys. So, we have Lysander. Let's go after it. Lysander, come back here. Get away. Get out of the way, Snorlax. I'm still not going to play... Oh, yeah. I've got to charge up my Evil Tall. Can Evil Tall just one-shot this? Five energies, six energies. Needs a muscle band. Needs actually needs a... Yeah. But no, I won't, I won't do it the fun way, man. Let's let's uh, use Foul Play. Aqua Blast. I don't have any water energies, so I don't have to discard anything. Thanks for dropping it down, man. I got a Verse Seeker. Even if he tries to escape, I think this is it. There are my two prize cards. This is my two prize. This is it. Yep, escape. Nope. Nope. Once I'm set up, I'm in total control. Hello again, Snorlax. Lysander. Oh, you want to... I can just get more cards this way, but I'm gonna end it easily. I know I can have already won, so we're gonna do this. Uh, we're just gonna retreat, and I'm gonna do it the shortest way possible, which is put this float stone on here. I'm not supposed to. It's supposed to be on Zora Arc, and we're gonna retreat, send out Zora Arc. We're gonna use the Verse Seeker, and he already knows what I'm dragging. I'm dragging that Lysander out, and drag this out. Yep, foul play. Let's copy it again. Let's end this foul play. Aqua Blast. Get out of here. Woo. That, that Gyarados is being stuck. Oh, man. Oh, okay. But got it. Round one. Round one. Moving on to round two, guys. Coming up soon. Yeah. So the Gyarados right there took out my evil tall, which would have one shot it. Without anything else, plan B. And I had to depend on Zora Arc, which could not quite copy its ability so you can see there it doesn't go very well for me he didn't have a big bench didn't have that great of attack um without water energies of course but was able to pull through because he over invested in gyarados and hey i was able to copy that greninja out there that i haven't seen in a while so next tournament match we have delphox no more spoilers Welcome let's get to it. second round of the tournament swirlix skates this can be... Oh, I need heads. Yes. 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 So, we're... Uh, ooh, Tiano. Ooh. We're so close. If I activate this, I'm definitely going to get two... Two cards. You know what? I'm going to do it. We're going to get Slurpuff immediately out. So, yeah. There's only one Slurpuff. But, okay. I got you out, and we're going to use Tasting right up front. So, Taste Away. And we're gonna save Tiano just for a bit. Oh my god, two Zoruas and a Zora Arc, and I can verse Seeker some buddies out. So we're gonna definitely gonna do that. And ugh. I'm thinking about Parallel City. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's rotate to Parallel City. I'm gonna constrict my hand this time around. So I have one more bench space. I'll end my turn, but he's gonna take. I'm gonna take less damage. Every turn, he's got to take. So yeah, even if you use Will of Wisp, which you should not use, he's gonna evolve it to Brazen. Uh oh, Del Fox is coming out soon. Go ahead, this card energy, two fire. Uh, oh man, this is gonna be even hard to survive a Del Fox's attack. So heads, ooh, we both got heads. We are lucky with our skates. And my Del, my Zorox copy is not gonna be very useful. So please fill up your bench space, Clairvoyant Eye. He's not gonna attack me, of course. I got. This is, you wouldn't discard energy for that. So look at the three cards. I guess whatever he wants in those three cards, he's going to get an X. So what am I going to get? I have the whole Zora arc line. But wait. Don't do anything yet. See what cards you have first. Okay, we have skates. Uh, this is Tails, guys. This is Tails. Yep, I, and I'm totally psychic. I know everything, pretty much. I can have Zora arc come out this turn. Its attack isn't going to do much. It's going to do 40 damage. Should I get Zora Arc, guys, at this point? Actually, I don't even have a Dark Energy. So, no. Let's go ahead and throw these out. Oh, we got Evil Tall. You're definitely going to take the next bench space. And let's go ahead and put a Dark Energy on... Uh, let's don't put the Dark Energy. I'm going to put this on the Evil Tall. 
And I think that's it, guys. I'm not gonna jump in. I'm just gonna leave my poor Slurpuff there. If Del Fox comes online, we will send out Evil Tall and get rid of it. There we go. Three fire energy. Jeez, Evil Tall is like, mmm, delicious. And poor Slurpuff. Uh oh, there it is. And how many damage? I don't quite remember. I think that's 110 or 130 damage. We're gonna take a look right now. 110 damage. So that's enough for Slurpuff to go down. Sorry, Slurpuff. You did a great job getting me all those nice cards, but if you don't have another bench Pokemon, I will. Oh, you want this card? And a Muscle Band, so he's gonna do severe damage to my Evil Doll. Severe, severe damage. But guess what? The stadium's not focusing the right way. It's gonna survive. The Slurpuff's like, yes! And he's like, I got you, man. I don't know why he did this, but I got you. Oh my gosh. Skates was head. My skates with tails. So he's got plenty of cards. Blaze Ball! 110 damage. Thank you very much, Stadium. Alright. So, we got Zora Art Break. You're up. And let's, uh... You know what? I, I want to go for round two. So I'm going to heal my evil tall guys. Okay. I'm not going to put a this on here or should I not yet not yet all right I think this is enough I think you're gonna survive we're gonna use evil ball 140 damage enough to KO this Del Fox get out of here how dare you hit me and guess what I can do that again I mean I can heal myself again through a verse seeker and we've got a nice draw system I don't have any bunch of bench space but I'm being shielded this is the price you pay for being with the shield oh, I can come I can come up here and heat tackle this thing or, let's see, I, I may just have enough energies on Evil Tall. What is your base damage? 20, 80 damage. My base damage is 80. But he's like, no. All those guards? Not a, not a, that's the second round of the tournament, guys. We're gonna go on to the third one and see how that one plays out. So, well, yep, we very short Del Fox match. If you have too many energies, Veltal, Evil Tall is gonna take care of you. Yup, and good thing it wasn't a... It was a Gyarados situation, but this time it didn't have six energies. Otherwise, it would just been a repeat. But next, next, struggle, 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 struggle against this darn, darn ghost. Okay, Welcome let's to see the how final match in the tournament. Gengar, wake the darkness. But he has quite a. Oh my God! Disabling my abilities. All right, so let's get this underway. I do not trust my first Zorua, guys. So we're definitely gonna grab out Swirlix, Swirlix, who's resistance is dark. Okay. Alright, I have my whole setup. This is really tough. This is really, really tough, but there's a chance the first Zero may go down. So go ahead and put energy here. And I'll end my turn. Please. Add more bench Pokemon. I am stuck and I'm out of cards. But luckily, I don't, he does not have the potential to one-shot me. At least a Zora Arc does. So, if he has a double colorless energy, which he does not, this is good. He's gonna use Night Attack, and I, I believe he's gonna attack this guy back here. Or he's gonna attack, yeah, he's gonna attack the one that I have energies on. Okay, I probably should have just added a double colors, but, alright. We're gonna go ahead and evolve it. And you know what, I'm afraid that he gets another energy to shield himself. I'm gonna have to put this energy on, and we're gonna have to heal you up. Just, just force. Force my hand to do that. So, that's it. I'm gonna stand in. We are gonna jump in, and we are gonna attack Mind Jack. 140 damage! So, he must retreat, escape. He already has the means to do so. Well, I'm, I'm stuck. I can repeat a Bridget, but I'm stuck for more cards. Please, Tiano, please, Burge. I really need you. Oh, man. Okay, I can see a problem with this deck already. We're definitely gonna have to add more supporters, guys. So, Zora Arc is up. He's got a final energy card that all that he needs to use the Dark Corridor. Ooh, a Muscle Band. Luckily, that's still not enough to take me out. And I can still use the Verse Seeker. To pull out. Oh, he's just gonna retreat. What? You're supposed to attack first before doing that. But he did not. He did not attack. Alright. Muscle Band. Alright, we're gonna charge the Muscle Band up. And this is all I can really do. My Jack, here we go. 90 damage. Not enough, but it would have been enough to one-shot this Gengar. 
Oh, Kangar, come back here, man. Come back here. Okay, so we got Unknown. We got Wobbuffet. Ooh, maybe I should start... I should actually put the stadium out. So now he... But I want him to put more cards... So he can, I, my Mind Jack will hurt more. So please, do put more Bench Pokemon down. Wobbuffet's going down, and I have the ability to heal off my Zoroark. Just charge it up that Wobbuffet. I guess he's just waiting for time. Float Stone. Oh, there's the retreat. I'm gonna be forced to heal myself. So it's like the Gengar's back. Hey, did you miss me? And he's gonna Dark Horde. Oh, resistance, but I can, I can't heal myself off completely. But I can heal off the poison, and he's probably gonna send out. It doesn't matter who he sends out. He probably should send out the one wolf that's not weak, which is this one right here. Has a free retreat. But I'm stuck. There we go. Free retreat takes. 20 damage. Oh, if it attacks me one more time, it may be screwed. Really? Yeah, if it attacks me one more time, it's screwed. Let's go ahead and charge you up. And we're going to completely heal you up. I'm going to grab this card. Grab out my Pokemon Senator Lady. Thank you, Nurse Joy. And we're going to heal you up. You're good to go. All right. Take a take a big stab at this. Mind Jack. 90 damage. Why would you put, put, put one more bench Pokemon out? Okay. So... This Gengar cannot attack me no matter what, due to particular energy I have on me. But man, I am stuck on cards. Where are my, where are my Slurpuff? Where my uh, Evil Sodas? Where my Chianos? Where are my Skates? So he's got another Gengar up. That Gengar is not going to survive if it comes out because of weakness damage. So, we'll see what he does. Oh, he's going to put an energy on. Alright. And let's let's see. Sycamore, man, you have such nice supporters. Birch, I can't believe I want to see Birch now, but I want to see Birch. Okay. So, all right, unknown. Oh, well, maybe I should really start constricting. No, please, put more Pokemon on your bench. Increase my power. And he he might be ready to go pretty soon too. All right, he's got a big nice hand. He's used up his energies. He's used up his supporters. Dimension Valley. Oh, I don't want you to have that. We're definitely gonna go in. We're definitely gonna go put something up. Okay, so this Wobbuffet may just take it, or he may he may retreat and take a take a big shot at it. There we go. But if you do that, I have a particular energy. It's gonna knock you out. What? You want to KO your own Pokemon? Oh well, thank you. So Wobbuffet's gonna come out. I may just have. I may be forced to retreat, guys. I may be forced to retreat because I really want to one shot this Gengar. So, he has to pick somebody to switch out. Please, pick this card. Nope, he's gonna send Wobbuffet. Bye-bye! Thank you! More cards, more cards. Yes, 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 yes! Two middle ones. They're always the luckiest. Wobbuffet! Pokemon Center Lady! Perfect! And now I, I took a little bit more damage. Okay. Wally. We can Wally. We can Wally and send you up, but I don't want to yet. I'm just gonna heal you because you are the magic miracle one. So, heal you up. And there's no reason for me to do anything else. I don't want him to have that stadium. So we're gonna go in, yeah, we're gonna have to constrict this place. So get out of here, Dimension Valley. And hey, Wobbuffet, you get out of here too. So, Mind Jack, three prize cards, woo! And uh, once you go to the middle, one, the top one's lucky. To get air, though, that's where I want you. The whole entire match. But now you're back here. Needs a double colors energy or the Dimension Valley to, to use this combo. Otherwise, I'm gonna one, no, I can't one shot him. He needs more bench Pokemon, so if he's careful and not to put too, mi too many bench Pokemon, I need two. So this is, he cannot put another bench Pokemon down, otherwise this Gengar is going to go down in one shot. Because I have a Muscle Band. Alright, so he put another energy on, he needs the Dimension Valley, that was not a double colorless energy. He needs, he needs to also throw this unknown away before, because I'm going to take it out. Sycamore, what, what cards are you throwing away? Okay, okay, Team Flare Gear, Wobble. I think I may have knocked out that Wobble Fit. Lysander vs. Seeker. Alright, this is it. Enhanced Hammer, can I take that away? That's fine. I can already jump in, or I can evolve into my Mega. Oh, he discarded it. Shoot. And he may just send out this Wobble Fit. I need my own Lysander. Alright, gotta. It's heads, he gets to knock out all my energies. He may just knock this one out. 
But remember, I have Zora Arc Break as well as this guy back here. So they both are ready to go into play. So what is he gonna do? Unknown. Farewell letter. It's Gengar. Man, Lysander. I want you. Okay. What am I gonna do next turn? I'm probably gonna have to force Wally not into Zora Arc Break. Although Zora Arc Break and just use the Zora Arc. Oh, he got his own Pokemon Center Lady. But he already used the supporter, I believe. Even if he healed it up, it would not it would not matter at this point. So, what else can he do, man? Dark corridor gun is resistance. Yes. Yes. And I can evolve myself into Zora Arc Break. Would I survive that attack? Or I could just heal myself again. Pokemon Center Lady, thank you, Nishoy! Wait, 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 I cannot use Mind Jack. Only this one can use Mind Jack. So I'm just gonna grab it for now. And choices. I, it looks like I'm gonna have to use the Zora Arc that has energy. This Zora Arc has energy. So I've used it up. This Wobbuffet's effect. This Wobbuffet's effect. I totally, totally forgot about that. So I'm gonna have to, this Zora Arc is gonna be forced to come down. Because I could not use stand in to uh, to finish it off. Okay, so this is what happens when you're stuck on cards. But yeah, he hasn't taken prize card. Looks like Zora Arc is gonna go down. Maybe I should have just bought top. I should have just used Tierno, guys. I should have just used Tierno. If I evolved that Pokemon Center Lady, gonna heal him up some. I guess I, uh, is okay. All right. Now he's gonna retreat, and Gengar is like, finally, I can finish this off. Ah. Oh. Psychic Assault. Oh, Gengar's not even going to finish it off. Wobbuffet's going to do it. So now, Zorok's like, Man, you took out my brother. I'm going to come and finish you off. Alright, let's do this. Slurpuff, finally. There you are. Alright, now, Tiano. I'm I'm stuck on cards, man. You need to help me out. Okay. So, we're going to use the Evil Soda. And I'm going to grab out Zora. Zora Arc Break. I'm gonna grab a Zora Arc Break. So, here we go. Now I can draw my card limit as double because I got a Slurp Puff out. Here we go. Uh, uh, I already used it. Parallel City. Yes, let's, let's flip it around. Nope, this is good. Get that Stadium out of here so he can't get those free attacks. Now I can copy his attack. It's not gonna do me anything. Let's go ahead and just use the regular Mind Jack. Yeah, 40 damage. That sucks. I don't have. I don't have uh, my uh, muscle band, so it doesn't do as much. And he doesn't have much bench Pokemon. Maybe he's being very smart and careful. Pokemon oh, saying, lady, you're still there for me. Oh, another bench Pokemon. Awesome. But he's going to send this Wobbuffet instead of the other one out. Probably. And Lysander, I really need you. This thing has a muscle band now. He put the energy on the wrong Pokemon, unless he has a Dimension Valley. If he can replace his Dimension Valley, which Birch... Birch, ooh, only Tails. But if you can replace it, then he'll be able to use his Psychic Dark Corridor. Tails, yes, yes, you dodged it. You dodged it. I still have another Inner Energy on you, so that you um, would be okay. But I'm good now. I have Slurpuff. And Gengar is going to come out, but wait, you don't have enough energies to attack. Forgot about this? Oh, shoot. McDizzy, you got to be careful, man. So he's like, I bet did not see the replace the stadium which is why he had the energy he placed it on this wobble fit not his Gengar so Gengar is like uh oh uh oh it's gonna use I can just use dark corridor I could I'm gonna use mind jack but I don't have a muscle band so he's gonna take a lot of damage but not get KO so he's like oh. Oh. okay so you'll figure it out that really soon All right one so here it is Gengar is up here it's poised to attack me it is only one attack. It's going to attack this uh, Zora Arc. So, which does more damage? I'm going to try to fish out. I'm going to try to fish out that Muscle Band. I know I have two more of them. Tierno, grab me some more cards, please. Evil Soda, Slurpuff Army has been taking a w took so long. But hey, you're now coming up online. And... Let's see. Let's see. I'm gonna have to use Mind Jack, but he he put two two bench Pokemon's. 
that is enough for me to do a KO. But I'm gonna make sure I take advantage of this setup. I cannot use anything that, that, that at this point. So we're gonna use Mind Jack still. Here we go, weakness damage, KO Gengar. Gengar does not like dark Pokemon. So two more prize cards. And I'll take these two. Is Zorua and Zora Arc Break. So here comes Wobbuffet. This the wounded one instead of the healthy one, but at least he has a free retreat and he can still retreat up. So this this ability lock is now up. I can't use stand in or tasting. And he's gonna use sick more man. He is on his eight cards left in his deck. And I I have the I have a slurp up team, it's still slow for me. Alright, one more prize card, and I still don't have dipped. He can retreat, get the Robo Substitute out. And I won't be able to do anything because Lysander, Lee Zong, where are you? Alright, so he's got this Dimension Valley. That was what he really needed last turn. Definitely gonna replace it and put more bench Pokemon on. So there we go. Dimension, this stadium has actually been doing good. Alright. Enhanced Hammer. Oh, he took that away. Okay. Okay, I'm still okay. I'm still okay. I don't. Zoroark and Evil Toll only need very few energies. Which is a good thing about this deck. Bad thing is you can see that the damage potential is still hard to meet. Which is why these dangerous energies actually got the KO on me. Alright, so. From what I can see, he should retreat, but Ro will substitute out because one more prize card is from easy enough for me to knock it out. Ooh, an Ultra Ball. Discarded the teammates. That teammates. But he played the supporter already. All right, so he has very little cards in his left deck. Left, it's gonna be unknown. Ooh, one card, one card. This is only gonna give him one card. Is it gonna be what you need, man? You're almost out, almost out. That's sick of market for you guys. And slurp up. Okay, lucky slurp up pulled me that muscle band I needed to KO. All right, what can you do? What do you need? Two more cards left. This looks one prize card. This looks like it, guys. Retreat. Send out Robo Subs to goodbye sometime. Find a way to make a comeback. All right, Lysander. Okay, I'll go. Go ahead, put Zoro out. And here we go. Go fishing, Lysander. Can you find me, Lysander? You found me a muscle band. That is not Lysander, but that's getting close. Can you find me a Lysander? Three cards. I just threw three cards. And they're not what I need. We're gonna put a double close energy on. And I'm just gonna have to be I'm forced to use the mind jack. Here we go. Get out of here. Robo substitute. Alright. One more prize card still still waiting. And the healthy wall effect comes up now. Because this one still has a free retreat. But the healthy one is up, so I can not one shot this unless he puts two more bench Pokemon down. Which is kinda hard to go but this 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 deck overall this is definitely a Gengar lock deck which oh he drew all his cards and luckily through through Pokemon Star Lady even with a bad draw and you because of my deck type is dark I had the advantage in this so yes lock deck doing okay doing okay okay so GG that's the last of his cards. GG back. And Psychic Assault Resistance you only. You see that having damage is such a problem. And that's it. That was his last card. I was I, I forgot it was his last card then, so I didn't end the game. Okay. So there it is. There it is, guys. Wow. Six. Six booster packs. Awesome. Awesome. So, tournament matches, that was a tough match. I mean, it's supposed to be a tough match. It's a lock deck. Gengar was never quite available without Lysander. Wobbuffet shutting my abilities, and man, he wasn't really using that many energies. So, Melto, well, he didn't even show up. And, oh, he wasn't using that much bend space. Great, so R can't take advantage of that. And attacked. Wobbuffet's 10 damage or his 60 damage wasn't that great either. So it was a struggle down to the very, very last cards. But luckily was able to pull through five booster packs. 
Now, what do I need to do to improve this deck? Pretty clear. I probably need a burst in an extra burst just in case I get a dead draw like that. So I can just... Hey, hopefully he'll draw me heads, maybe a sick and just grab me more cards. I need more Lysander. That was very apparent in the Gyarados. If I could Lysander it out, finish it off with my evil tall. And if I could Lysander with Gengar's out. So yeah, two Lysanders. Ah, go for three. Go for three. There's a possibility that maybe a non-Slurpuff engine may work out better. Because they do take a lot of bench space. But it does make this deck very resilient. So deck rating, I say B. Because this is all it could be better. It's not A yet. And it's resilient because I can't quite shut it down. He discarded by energies in that last match there. Nope, I only need one or two. So not using too many energies is great. He shut down my abilities. Well, I still got Tierno on my roller skates and my supporters. Great, I'm good to go. And um, he shut down. Well, there was no item lock, but Slurpuff would have just kept things moving along. So yeah, this is very resilient, but it does depend on what your opponent is doing. Because if they have decks like these, uh, well, it's tough. It's tough not having nice stuff to copy. All right, so that's the tournament match. This is a revisit to an awesome, awesome deck. And you're like, Donald, this songs. I haven't quite heard them before. Or maybe you have from Undertale. Yes, very, I found these songs to be very inspiration, inspirational. Undertale is an awesome game with nice storylines, something I really, really like. So Undertale's Toby Fox, creator of the uh, Undertales. Okay, enough about Undertales. It's great. And those were the songs that you heard during the matches. So, all right. Thank you very much, Anna Groves and the Frenchels. I will see you back in my kitchen real soon. Possibly from Mewtwo tomorrow. Okay? Bye-bye.